Since over the past few weeks, we had a global uh, phenomenon that was the flood, fast flash floods. These are the floods at the end of the summer happening everywhere where people don't expect them usually to have, a, uh, you know, any excessive rain, at least in the northern hemisphere. This is Libya. As you can see, the Derna is completely ruined by that. The satellite images showed that also to us that we can see before and after images are heartbreaking as you can see here all the town is flooded even the sea is now discolored as you can see here the water was rushing toward the bridge and the cars were trying just to back up for the you know safety back away look at that car how speedy it goes this is from the uh, Indonesia as you can see here we had the flood in Indonesia Again, people probably don't expect such things in the summer of the Northern Hemisphere. These are all Northern Hemisphere. But if you think that is just limited to Northern Hemisphere, I will show you something else. That is from Brazil in the Southern Hemisphere. And this is the area that people didn't expect. But they usually have a very good network of the river. Rain and everything. You never hear about the flood in Brazil. I'm sure it happens, but this one also happened. As if everybody is just reporting this. If the flood isso, happened in the past, probably it was not reported too much. Now we have a report. And above all, now we have a flood also. Flood warning in the United States of America and in the Col British Columbia, in the Canada, uh, even in the Vancouver, one of the highest uh, precipitation areas of the planet Earth. They expect now the uh, flood. This is the what you see in the New York, Brookhaven to... Uh, Boston and Prov Providence, New, and to Lempster, Hartford, all these towns that are named after the localities in the in the Britain also exist in those areas, and uh, New England areas of the thing, uh, and United States of America. This is from Netherlands, Holland, in Maastricht, the town of Maastricht, and as you can see in Europe, we have also these fast fast floods. We had in Spain, we had in Greece, huge fires. Then the flood came, turn it off turned the f wildfire, but now it caused flood. So it shows that we are not prepared. In many areas, people are not uh, prepared. They didn't expect this excessive rain. Historically, they didn't expect that. And they were building their homes in the pathway of the flood.